Is the American dream really dead? I, I don't feel like the American dream is dead, but I definitely feel like it needs to be resuscitated. Because for so many of us, it, it, it's just that. It's a dream. It's something nice to talk about, but not something feasible, not a reality. And while I do not get political on this app, I want you to look at the two most polarizing presidents in the last 20 years. Say what you want to about either of them. I'm not here for that. But Obama ran and won on the idea of hope and change. And Trump ran and won on the idea of make America great again. Keep jobs in this country. They're two completely different people. But you know what they did do? They rallied the American people. But they made people who felt downtrodden and forgot about, people who felt like the system never represented them, they made those people feel appreciated. And I don't know about you, but what bothers me the most is our elected officials are so disconnected from the everyday average Joe people that they are sworn to protect and represent. And look, the dream's gonna be different for everybody. My dream's gonna be different than yours. But what should not change is your ability to be able to pursue that dream. You should be able to work and make a living and support yourself. Both sides of the aisle used to be able to hide behind it. They'd use words like entitled to make everybody turn against each other. Well, you're not working hard enough or you're making too much money, but now the math ain't mathin. Because of inflation and record profits and, and no salary caps and tax breaks and everything that they've done, the math ain't mathin and people are starting to go, hey, hold on a second. I am doing that. I do work 40 hours a week. I have to have a side hustle. I'm putting gas and groceries on credit cards. I'm no longer the problem. You're the problem. Oh, they love to talk about bootstraps. And now you got tons of people who go, I pulled myself up by the bootstraps. I went to college. I'm in debt because I went to college. You said if I did this, this was going to happen. And now you've changed the rules of the game. No, I, I don't think that the dream is, is dead. I think people are waking up to the idea that the dangling carrot that used to keep everybody going is no longer there. And the people who were dangling it didn't have the carrot in the first place. I'm not right wing or left wing. I believe they're two wings on the same bird and that bird ain't singing for you and me. But if you want to see change, I think it's time that we start holding those who would hold us accountable, accountable. It's those hard questions, demand answers. And if you have to vote them out, do what is best for you. That's the new American dream.